Hello everybody, it is me Train Dude here. Welcome to the future of Singapore's transportation network. Today, we're exploring the Jurong Region Line, JRL, a transformative MRT project set to enchant connectivity in the western region of Singapore. So, in this video, we'll be taking a look at the future Jurong Region Metro Line project in Singapore. Before we begin, make sure you subscribe with the notification bell on so you can stay up to date on the latest architectural projects and statistics. The Jurong Region Line is Singapore's 7th MRT line, designed to serve the western regions including areas like Zhou Chu Kang and Jurong, spanning approximately 30 kilometers with 26 stations. The line is structured in an H shape, connecting key residential units and industrial zones. The Zhurong Region Line will be developed in three stages. Stage 1, 2027, Chuchu Kong to Boon, Lei Tuas. Stage 2, 2028, Tenga to Pandan Reservoir. And Stage 3, 2029, Enterprise to Jurong Pier and Nanyang Gateway to Pen Kong Hill. The Jurong Region Line will feature three interchange stations at Boon Bay, Jurong East, and Cho Chu Kang, enhancing connectivity across the MRT network. This development will take approximately 60,000 more households within a 10 minute walk to a train station, significantly improving accessibility. Construction milestones include the completion of the third viaduct, crossing an expressway and significant progress at key stations like Boon Bay and Bahar Junction. Looking ahead, the Zhurong Region Line is set to extend further. Phase 1, late 2030s, Pandan Reservoir to West Coast, connecting with the Cross Island Line. Phase 2, early 2040s, West Coast to Kent Ridge, connecting with the Circle Line. These extensions aim to reduce travel time to the city center by up to 20 minutes. The Zhurong Region Line will feature state-of-the-art trains designed for efficiency and comfort, manufactured by Hyundai Rotum. These trains are currently being assembled and tested to ensure a seamless commuting experience. Residents and businesses in the Western Region are posed to benefit immensely from the Zhurong Region Line with improved access to educational institutions, industrial hubs, and residential areas, fostering greater economic and social integration. The Zhurong Region Line represents a significant leap forward in Singapore's commitment to enhancing public transportation. Stay tuned as we continue to track its progress and impact on our city's landscape. So what do you think about this project? Do you like it or dislike it? And why? Thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.